All right, everyone. We uh, just got to the trailhead. It's another day in the llama life. So, yeah, stay tuned. It's going to be an awesome day. We have 12 llamas, three guys, myself, my good friend Kobe, and uh, Marshall, one of our guides. So we are just uh, taking a weekend to go drop a camp. Um, and next week, um, Randy and myself and uh, Lucas will be headed up to the high country where we're going to look for uh, elk in Montana. So we are... Uh, we're kind of coming in a few days before the hunt. We're dropping our camp or water, lots of gear, and uh, we're all sick of camelwood up. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited. So, Marshall cut llamas for us. I was in uh, Idaho dropping llamas off this morning, and so we kind of all just kind of met in the middle. And we got a trailer full of llamas, trailer full of gear, and we're uh, we're gonna have at it. Come on. All right, Colby, here's Donnie. Mm -hmm. Okay, big time. <laughs> Llamas! That's Jimmy, big time. He's a big time llama. Now I got a feeling we're going to have a good few days. All right, Scout. Good boy. All right, just going to put your saddle on here, little buddy. Scout's just a five-year-old, so pretty new to packing. He's been on a lot of training trips, a lot of pack trips, and he's starting to finally get good at it. Here we are with Marcus, the public land loan. Marcus has been in uh, five states already. Been on a jet boat, Frank Church River, no return wilderness. He's been in Utah, on mazes in the desert, Alpine Lakes, Yellowstone, Lamar, Beckler Valley, everywhere. And uh, he's been in uh, the Grovance, the Wyoming Range, the Wind Rivers, um, the Jedi Smith. Again, thanks to Onyx Maps, Loophole Optics, and Randy Newberg for putting together old Marcus boy here. and. Uh, helping conservation in public lands. guys well we are on the trail officially we got all the boys here the sun's beating down on us pretty good 12 llamas are all packed up tight and we just started our climb so whew, we got 2700 feet total we've probably done maybe 200 and uh, <laughs> most of it takes place over three miles so We'll keep you updated. Hopefully we can get to the top before five and get set camp set up in glass a little. Well, my friends, my YouTube amigos, we're still climbing the mountain. The boys are doing pretty good. They're all eating. You can tell by how far Marshall's up there. It's pretty steep country. Anyway, they're eat, all llamas are eating the bunch grass, same thing they look like to eat up here at this elevation. I think we climbed about 800 feet. And uh, the other ones that are out of shape are this old timer behind me and myself. Climbing away. This is a 
really terrible joke, Bo. This sucks. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, Love you. Hey, Love you. The deep saddle, and come draw a line and kind of come this way, and they're just, just they're all within two more yards of that saddle on this side of it, on this side of it, and then on the big side, you know. You come up here. Hello, me some help. All right, my friends, we just got to the Top. We're gonna skirt all the way around the top here. Get to camp. It's about 45 elk over there. Three bulls and a spike. One little nice six point. And uh, yeah, so we're almost at camp, and we're in elk country, right where we'd want to be. We're about a half hour late, but I don't think it's gonna mess with our schedule too much. It's awesome to get up here.
and sneaking on him with Kobe so he could get a bull and uh, somebody killed an elk right on the side of the border. So we said, and he said his buddy's down there after those elk, so we're just hanging back watching the show. <laughs> just uh, wish we could be down there, but trying to be respectful and uh, let them have a chance. They were here first, so we'll have a go at it in the morning, maybe, hopefully. It's kind of a weird deal, but I feel like it's the right thing to do. So that's what we're doing. Karma, hopefully. Hopefully tomorrow, a big guy comes right by a camp. Pretty special night in Elkwoods, huh? He's like 15 yards. Right next to the tree on the right side. about to close out shooting light so don't think they're gonna get one they're gonna pack that bull back on back down tonight and so we asked them if we could hunt these elk in the morning they said it'd be good so we'll see if we can get the Kobe a shot in the morning Kobe's what do you think man yeah. <coughs> but let's just call it a day come on a successful we got to camp that was our goal we got to chase the elk here hunter bugle so it's good yeah that was cool Who wouldn't want to come up here with the crew after this? Okay. <laughs>